Merry meet and blessed be. I'm Wyden Odinson, High Priest of the Temple of Gaia, Tenth Priest of the Universal Gnostic Church, etc., etc., whatever. Welcome to the Sabbath School class. I sometimes get a little cynical reading advice columns, especially some of them that have a history of being a little sanctimonious, some of them that have a little bit of a history of being, with me, of being kind of Pollyanna. I'll never forget some years ago when I was looking for a decent job and the job I was in wasn't too decent and there was an article, you know, a letter in there from somebody in a similar situation to mine. The difference was that he was an engineer who had been laid off and instead of being an air engineer in the aerospace industry making good money, he was he was at the counter serving people burgers. And the worst thing about it was when somebody he used to work with came up to the window. Well, I remember what it was like doing telephone sales. And I didn't like it when this particular advice columnist, the only thing that she could say was, there's dignity in every job. Not when you know what kind of an education you have and what kind of experience you have somehow you can't get anybody to hire you. And the same columnist a while back had one pennies from heaven. But then I looked and I realized it's something that I've already done, something that I'm doing. For once this is not Pollyanna, this is something that is can work. And it worked so well for me that I wanted to share it with you, just in case it might work for you. There's an old saying, find a penny, pick it up, all day long you'll have good luck. And it dates back from the days when you're not talking about the U.S., you're talking about England, and in those days a penny was a reasonable amount of money that you could actually do something with. There was a soldier's song in those days, I got sixpence. Okay. Find a penny, pick it up. All day long you'll have good luck. And I've been in the habit of doing that. And, well, here's one for instance. If I happened to find this one on the ground, I would pick it up and I would look at the date. 2001 is what this one happens to be. And I think about it, something important and good and positive that happened in that year. 2001, that's easy for me. That was the year that Lady Stormy and I got married. And then I put it in my pocket, not in the pocket where I keep my regular change, but in another pocket. Later on, when it accumulates, I put it in a jar. And when that jar accumulates, I take it to Coinstar, which is a machine that counts up your pennies and gives you some money for it. And it goes into the Temple of Gaia. That's besides the point, beside the point other than the fact that I keep it separate from my regular money. And I have that thought of something positive that happened the year that that coin was brand new. And you know what? It follows me. Yeah, I will. I'll see something that day. 
There will be something positive that day having to do with that thought that came to me because of finding that. There are some of you who are here because you're wondering how to make magic happen. This is one of those ways. This is one of those ways to bring you into closer contact with those things which are magical and positive. So try this one out. See a penny on the ground? See what year it was? Think about something really wonderful that happened to you that year. Hold that thought in your mind for the day. And keep that penny separate. Which is not to say that it can't happen with nickels and dimes. But a lot of people don't look at pennies. And that's part of the clue. You're looking at something that a lot of people don't look at. If you're asking when you'll see magic actually happen, look for it and see. I might bless it be. Uriel's Gifts and the Secrets in Plain Sight are sponsored by the Temple of Gaia. At Temple of Gaia, we don't train you to our path. We show you how to find and pursue your own path. Above all, we tried to provide a great place to come together and to share. We're located in Collingdale, Pennsylvania, just outside of Philadelphia, and wherever cyberspace can be reached. To learn more, visit our website at templeofgaiainc.org or our meeting place in cyberspace at templeofgaia.ning.com. Thank you for coming. Feel free to return at any time. We intend to always have something for you here. Blessed be. This has been a presentation of the Wise Ones Net. Merry part and blessed be.